Isaiah chapter 54. And all the children shall talk of the law, and great shall be the peace of thy children. Verse 17 says, No weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper, and every tongue that shall rise against thee in judgment thou shalt condemn. Amen. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and the righteousness of me, said the Lord. Amen. Gracious Father, you are the Lord. Take all of this piece of bread. And whatever you want me to do, as I open up my mouth and wrestle with you, that you let your word line upon some heart this day, that they will make a decision before the world again. In Jesus' name we pray. They said in the book of evangelism to preach the Seventh Day Message, Seventh Day Adventist Message, you have to live the Three Angels Message. Revelation 14, 6 and 7 say, I saw another angel fly in the midst of heaven, having the everlasting gospel, to preach unto them that dwell on the earth, and to every nation. Can the common people say in a loud voice, Fear God and get glory to Him before His hour is come? Amen. Amen. And worship Him that made heaven and earth and the sea and the fountains of waters. My message today no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Amen. Jesus began his ministry by calling 12 people, 12 men. To accompany him on a, on a unique journey that would lead him from, on, that would climax at the cross. The 12 were distinguished by the ordinariness, by the talent, power, opposition. Jesus had a unique way of choosing this man. In Matthew chapter 4, Matthew chapter 4, verse 18, Matthew 4, verse 18, follow with me. And Jesus walking by the sea of Galilee saw two brethren, Simon, called Peter, and Andrew, his brother, casting a net into the sea. For they were fishes. Can you roll it off, please? And he saw, and he said unto them, Follow me, and I will make you fishes. Of man. And again, I said unto you that if help me over this, help me. And straightway they left the nets and followed him. Jesus does, don't call, they 
lazy people. something happened. 